Hi guys. So we're gonna I'm gonna show you um, a bit of a quick dinner as well, uh, not just a bake. Um, so because it's almost nine time here, uh, we are getting ready to to have dinner, and I'm doing something really quick and easy. These are courgettes, which you obviously peel, take the core out, um, add salt and pepper on top. And I really love the green onions, so chop a bit of the green onions quickly and shove it in there. You're going to fill them up with cream cheese. I took Philadelphia cream cheese, the light one. I mix it up with a bit of green onions and pepper as well. So now what we're going to do with this cream cheese, we're going to fill up the actual courgette. So, uh, to work, to work. I am helping myself with two little teaspoons just so I can move around quickly this is so easy and it's like takes you about half an hour to make and it's very very nice and tasty um, it's, it's nothing nothing to it to be honest and it's just different it's not something that you find everywhere um, when I first made this dish to, uh, to Roy, my partner, he was amazed. He was like, oh my god, that's so simple and so good, you know. Because that's what we're aiming for. Simple and good and easy to make. Because, you know, you don't want to spend all your day in the kitchen. Or if I could, I would. <laughs> Unfortunately, um, I need to go to work as well. <clears throat> so, because we don't want to spend our whole day in the kitchen, we're trying to prepare easy, quick stuff. And this is one of those quick and easy stuff to make. Like for sure. And trust me, when it's done, that courgette is going to be moist with the cheese and it's going to have mozzarella on top and mozzarella is going to be melted or a bit crusty it's going to be just yum mm. I can I cannot wait to taste it I'm telling you that it's going to taste amazing as usual right so we Whichever cheese you've got, or you prefer, this is half the mozzarella. It can be anything. Um, but yeah, just to cover it all up really nicely with the mozzarella cheese, which is going to melt in the oven. if you want more water like this here I'll show you you can add a bit a bit more water it's not as much sauce in it as you can see so you can add a bit more water it's the same bowl and just make a bit more sauce it's just gonna thicken and it's gonna taste really nice so normally this stays in the oven for at least about 45 minutes so um, the oven will go and then I'll come back to you guys when it's done, when it's ready to eat. See you later. The food is out of the oven. Look at this. As I said, the cheese is going to be melted. 
look at that amazing sauce. Ooh, plates are ready. We're gonna have dinner. So 